Thanks for staying with us here on TVC News. Now, the Gumbi State Judiciary has established a tribunal for adjudication of tax matters. The tribunal would be responsible for all disputes relating to taxes, assessment, fines, and recovery. A correspondent, Lara Deemi, reports. Gumbi State is ranked first in the ease of doing business by the National Bureau of Statistics. This accolade is one that the state is working on improving upon. The establishment of a tax tribunal is part of the grand plan to further improve investor confidence, ensure systemic stability, and speedy dispute resolution. Legal professionals want members of the tribunal to adjudicate with these goals in mind. I urge the tribunal to have a sense of justice and fairness in application of the law. The tribunal should be lenient to businesses that are providing social security services. This includes health, education, food vendors, and legal services. We would want the investors to come, but let them not fear that any small mistake they are going to face the wrath of the law. So I ask the Honorable Chairman and the members of the tribunal to temper justice with mercy in their judgment so that investors will not be scared away. With Nigeria facing grievous economic challenges, there is a renewed tax drive to boost government revenue. The tax tribunal ensures that erring individuals and organizations are compelled to meet their obligations. The tribunal is an important component of the new tax policy that gives all parties, all parties the opportunity to explore other dispute resolution mechanisms before gaining access to the regular court system that is full of technicalities and unnecessary delays in proceedings. It is my hope that the establishment of this tribunal will curb the incidence of tax evasion, guarantee fairness and transparency of the tax system, enhance taxpayers' confidence, provide a speedy determination of matters. Gombe State's monthly tax revenue has almost tripled in four years, growing from an average of 240 million in 2018 to over 600 million in 2022. The tribunal protects all sides of the tax equation, yet it is expected that revenue that would accrue to the government would increase. Landry Adeyemi, CVC News, Gombe.